Marie Curie was a trailblazer in radioactivity research. Her groundbreaking work led to the discovery of polonium and radium. Curie's inventions revolutionized cancer treatment and X-ray technology, but her dedication came at a steep price. Years of exposure to radiation caused a plastic anemia. Curie died at 66, her body ravaged by the very elements she studied. Albert Einstein's name is synonymous with genius. His theory of relativity turned physics on its head. It paved the way for nuclear power and GPS technology. Despite his peaceful nature, Einstein's work indirectly contributed to the atomic bomb's creation. This haunted him until his death. Einstein died at 76 from an abdominal aortic aneurysm, refusing surgery. His last words remain a mystery, spoken in German to a nurse who didn't understand the language. Nikola Tesla, the wizard of electricity, invented the alternating current system powering our homes today. He dreamed of providing free wireless energy to the world. But Tesla's brilliance was matched by his eccentricity. He died alone in a New York hotel room, in debt and obscurity. The man who lit up the world spent his final years in darkness, feeding pigeons in the park. Alan Turing, the father of computer science, cracked the Nazi Enigma code during World War II. His work saved countless lives and laid the foundation for modern computing. But Turing's genius couldn't protect him from societal prejudice. Prosecuted for his homosexuality, he was forced to undergo chemical castration. Turing died at 41 from cyanide poisoning. His death was ruled a suicide, though some suspect foul play. Galileo Galilei revolutionized astronomy with his improved telescope. He provided evidence for the heliocentric model, challenging the church's teachings. For his troubles, Galileo faced the Inquisition and spent his final years under house arrest. He died at 77, blind and disillusioned, his works banned by the Catholic Church. Isaac Newton, the father of classical physics, made groundbreaking discoveries in optics and gravity. His laws of motion are still taught in schools today. But Newton's brilliant mind was plagued by mental health issues. He suffered from paranoia and mood swings, likely exacerbated by mercury poisoning from his alchemical experiments. Newton died at 84, never having known a woman, his genius overshadowed by eccentricity. Rosalind Franklin's X-ray diffraction images were crucial in discovering DNA structure, yet she didn't receive proper credit during her lifetime. Franklin died at 37 from ovarian cancer, likely caused by her work with X-rays. Her contributions were only fully recognized years after her death. Antoine Lavoisier, the father of modern chemistry, identified oxygen and hydrogen. He revolutionized chemical nomenclature and helped develop the metric system. But Lavoisier's scientific achievements couldn't save him from the French Revolution's reign of terror. He was guillotined at 50, his life's work cut short by political turmoil. Ignaz Semmelweis discovered the importance of hand washing in preventing the spread of disease. His findings could have saved countless lives, but the medical community ridiculed his ideas. Semmelweis suffered a nervous breakdown and was committed to an asylum. He died at 47, ironically from an infection contracted during his confinement. Percy Julian, a pioneering black chemist, synthesized medicinal compounds from plants. His work led to affordable treatments for glaucoma and arthritis. But Julian faced relentless racism throughout his career. His house was firebombed twice. Julian persevered, but the constant stress likely contributed to his liver cancer. He died at 76, his legacy overshadowed by the prejudice he endured. These scientists' stories reveal a pattern. Brilliant minds often pay a high price for their discoveries. Some, like Curie and Franklin, fell victim to the very forces they studied. Others, like Turing and Julian, faced societal prejudices that cut their lives and careers short. The tragic ends of these scientists raise questions about the cost of progress. How many groundbreaking discoveries have we lost due to prejudice, politics, or premature deaths? What price do we ask our brightest minds to pay for the advancement of knowledge? Consider Nikola Tesla. His dream of free wireless energy could have revolutionized the world, but financial troubles and ridicule from his peers drove him to isolation. How different might our world be if Tesla had received the support he needed? Or think about Rosalind Franklin. Her work was instrumental in one of the biggest scientific discoveries of the 20th century. Yet she died without recognition her contributions overlooked due to gender bias in the scientific community. 
These stories also highlight the dangers scientists face in pursuit of knowledge. Marie Curie's notebooks are still radioactive today, too dangerous to handle without protective gear. How many other scientists are risking their lives in labs around the world, working with dangerous substances or in hazardous conditions? The persecution of scientists for their ideas is another troubling theme. Galileo's conflict with the church shows how threatening new ideas can be to establish power structures. Even today, scientists face backlash and threats for research that challenges popular beliefs or powerful interests. Mental health is another recurring issue. The intense pressure and isolation that often come with scientific work can take a severe toll. Newton's paranoia and Semmelweis's breakdown are stark reminders of the psychological cost of pushing the boundaries of human knowledge. But it's not all doom and gloom. These scientists, despite their tragic ends, left legacies that continue to shape our world. Curie's work in radioactivity paved the way for modern cancer treatments. Einstein's theories underpin much of modern physics. Turing's work in computer science laid the foundation for the digital age. Their stories serve as both inspiration and warning. They show the heights human intellect can reach and the pitfalls that await those who dare to challenge the status quo. What can we learn from these tales of genius and tragedy? First, the importance of supporting and protecting our scientists. How many world-changing discoveries are we missing out on because brilliant minds lack resources or face discrimination? Second, the need for a holistic approach to scientific progress. We must consider not just the potential benefits of new discoveries, but also their potential costs to individuals, society, and the environment. Third, the value of diversity in science. Franklin and Julian's stories show how prejudice can hinder progress. Imagine the breakthroughs we could achieve if everyone had an equal opportunity to contribute to scientific knowledge. Lastly, these stories remind us of the human element in scientific discovery. Behind every groundbreaking theory or world-changing invention is a person with hopes, fears, and flaws. As we continue to push the boundaries of scientific knowledge, let's remember the sacrifices of those who came before us. Let's strive to create a scientific community that supports its members, values diversity, and considers the broader implications of its work. The next time you use a computer, get an X-ray, or benefit from any of the countless technologies these scientists help create, take a moment to reflect. Think about the brilliant minds behind these inventions and the high price many of them paid for their contributions to human knowledge. In the end, the stories of these scientists remind us that the pursuit of knowledge is both a noble and a perilous endeavor. It's up to us to ensure that future generations of scientists can stand on the shoulders of giants without sharing their tragic fates.